summarize the classical, country-based international trade theories. What are the differences between these theories, and how did the theories evolve? The classical theory of trade is based on the theory of labor cost value. This theory affirms that goods are exchanged against each other according to the relative amounts of labor embodied in them. Goods that have equal prices embody equal amounts of labor. Adam Smith gives the next known illustration. If, with the same expenditure of labor one can kill either one beaver or two deer at the same cost, then a beaver will always trade in the market for two deer. Thus, the exchange ratio or prices are determined only by the relative costs of the labor force, by their influence on supply and demand. In addition, the classical theory of international trade based on the country stated that a country's wealth is determined by its possessions of gold and silver. On the contrary, countries would import goods with insufficient resources in their countries but with higher demand. Finally, theories evolve when new questions are asked on a subject and new evidence is found and, as a result, the theory developed and become accepted by other experts.